Good morning, family. I've got a bit to go through today. So, um, we'll get into it. And, yeah. I've had a good week. Right, first thing. I scored me a, a blue Ike. 40% silver. I, I didn't have one in the, in the silver frame with the blue chip, so I thought I'd get one. It was 1971. Silver Eisenhower. So that's going to be good. All in this folder, put the COA in right there. So that's first up. So that's cool. 71. That's great. Second thing I got was a 1966 mint set. That's pretty cool. I like these holders. So yeah, there's a 1966. That's pretty cool. And then I got the 1972 proof set. I didn't have this one, so proof set. That, that one cent is so cool. Well, they're all pretty cool. The nickel's turning out pretty well. So there's there. Next thing is the Canadian Mint. We've got another one. It's the 1885 to 1985 National Parks Moose I think, I'm sure it's Proof Coins I think these are 50% 50% silver That's cool they have to go in my collection because I've got the uh, polar bear and a couple of other ones. I've got a Canada's. And yes, next thing is I finally got one. I've, I've been after one of these for a long time. It's the 1893 Columbian Expedition. Oh. Dropping everything today. Got the boat and everything. It's got the map of the world under there. It's pretty cool. Always wanted one, so yeah, I finally scored one for quite a reasonable price. So yeah, I'll flip that up later on. And there's that. Um, I finally, I've got uh, 1887 for the album, Indian Head Scent. That's an um, just okay order, just for the album follow. So we don't get many Indians over here, obviously. Picked up a 1901 V-Nickel. It's pretty cool. Building my V-Nickel collection. I've got, I have to put a scoop on this one because I can't see it. Oh, 1902 farthing. Pretty good shape, really good shape. Awesome. I put these sort of things up all the time over here because that's sort of heaps of it over here. What else? Well, I've got a couple of pennies as well, but in that same same order, I've got a 1876. If anyone wants any of these, just let me know. I've got plenty, and I've got a really nice 1936. Awesome, awesome penny. So yeah, anyone wants any of those? I've got plenty of those. And I've got this one just for it. Album full, I didn't have a 1974D. So yeah, 
also scored that too. And that's in the same sort of set. Those are just a few coins from the trade New Zealand trade me. So I pick that up. So that's those three. Um, oh, and these two wonderful looking coins. These are wonderful. Look, Sacagawea dollars. Look how toned they are. You can see the, see the trying to get the toning for you. Just rainbows everywhere. Uncirculated condition. So I got two of them. They're all a little bit different tones. As you can see, I'm trying to get that. Just yeah, they're beautiful in person. So yeah, I've got two of those. So if anyone wants one of those, just let me know. Just let me know. All right. I'm gonna put those over there now. And yeah, I've got an 1877 City of Liberty Dawn. Pretty good shape. Story behind that one, but yeah, I, I was sort of bidding on an 1877 Indian. I thought it was, you know, I thought I had the Holy Grail, and I was, you know, got it for really cheap. I said, oh my god, but yeah, they had a listing written down wrong, and it was supposed to be for this one. So, anyway, I was happy anyway with what I paid for it. So, so I got that, and this is cool. What's this? This is the world's smallest US coin replicas. Whole set. Got the Ike. Ike. Got the um, Susan B. Anthony. And half dollar, quarter, nickel and penny. And dime. Pretty cool, eh? Must be original because um, the staples are a bit rusty and stuff like that. But that's pretty cool. <laughs> I just picked it up for, for a laugh. It's, I think that's quite cool. It was down my collection anyway. It's pretty cool. Alright, another one. I've got the Year of the Dragon. Reverse proof. With the Lion Privy on it. And the Queen on the back. So yeah, that's a pretty cool added, added to my silver collection. I had to get one of these because this is one that was one of my favourite video games when I was a kid. It was Sonic, 30 year anniversary. Isn't that cool? Made in Nui, which is the new New Zealand mint anyway. You see, it's got the rings around the outside. It's, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool coin. I was glad to pick that up. Right, another one. I've got, I picked up the two ounce shield. These are cool. These are cool. What a cool design. Very cool. Two ounce. Right, what else have I got? And yeah, no, I don't know what to do for family, so I want some ideas. Because no one's claimed this. For the number 13, I can redraw it, or we can give it away some way else, because no one's claimed it. No one's emailed me. So give me some ideas, family, and we can either redraw it and give them another week or something, another week, and redraw it. And so if someone else has the number, they can have it. Because it's been a long time. So, yeah, they're, they're, they're just a thought. Oh, and I've got this coin, that's right. If anyone wants, this is, um, it's not silver, but I've never seen it. I want to show you like this. It's got new, all the New Zealand um, coins around the outside, all the designs. From the two dollar one dot, you know, one cent, two cent, 
five cent, ten cent, twenty, the new, the new um, twenty, and the fifty cent. It's, it's, it's a pretty cool coin. I only got it for a dollar, so yeah, well, why not? Dollar for a dollar. It's copper nickel, nineteen ninety-two. So it's a proof. So yeah, right. And another thing, we can open this one. If anyone wants one of these, I've got two. This is my second one. I'm not going to take the other one out of the box. I'm going to leave it in the box. But we can have a look at this one. This is going to be my one. So the other one is 1846. This is 1826. They only did. Um, minted 2018 of the of this coin so if anyone wants one of these let me know i'll i'll um i'll trade like a two gram pay dude or something like that because they're worth quite a bit but if anyone wants to do it two gram pay dude we'll have a look at it eh? before you be before you just push the button just have a look at it comes in it's nice plastic I've had a look at this one but look at this nice nice box nice box open it like that nice box I'm not gonna show you the coin yet but there it is it's a New Zealand Manuka honeybee. That's the, that's the manuka flower. It's it, it's in the bushlands. It's a dark honey, like yeah. That it's it's runny, but it's really dark, and it's got all the um, a lot of healing properties in it. And that, that's where they find it. Is in, in um, a lot of um, beekeepers put hives in it in the bush areas, and that's what they come up with. Manuka honey, it's awesome. Right, you pull the coin out. So it's it's it is colorized. So here it is. Put the honey bee on it. And the flower. So yeah, if anyone wants the 18, number 1846, let me know. Two grand pay dirt. That's cheap. For one of these. Because you can't get them anymore, they're all sold out. Very awesome. Very awesome. So yes, just let me know. Cause I'll just keep a hold of it because why wouldn't you? It's, they're sold out and I've got two of them. This is the 1826 number huh? Yeah, 118. I can't even talk. Mm -hmm. 1826. The other one is 1846. It hasn't been opened, I haven't opened it. So that's yeah that's that just let me know good news bought the three my three pay dirt dealers that I get off pay dirt off in New Zealand all back on the claims they've all emailed me and I got pay dirt on the way look what I got today two bags two bags of the golden bait Lucky strike. Lucky strike. So one of the five has the um, two to three am times amount of gold. And every time I've, I've pulled out half a gram out of these bags to nothing under 0 0.3. And these are only like 40, 45 New Zealand. So that's only about oh, just over $30 US. But that's not too bad. 
and it's a good fun you get a good amount of dirt one 1.3 kilos of dirt is what you get the pan out and that's pretty fun go and have a look on the Heidi and Conan's channel they've pan out a couple of these so um yeah so but my other friend Carl and my other friend um, Brett, they, they um back on the claims as well, so I've, I've got um, some of their dirt on the way as well, which is yeah, really, really good stuff. So that's that family. I hope you're all well. I'm doing a bit better now, starting to come right. So do something good for someone and pass it forward. Peace.